Welcome everybody to the next commentary playthrough on the channel and as you can see on the screen and obviously in the title of the video today is the day of the Elden Ring release. Um, now I was hoping to get this out a little bit earlier but due to work I couldn't um, play earlier which is pretty annoying but uh, yeah Elden Ring. So a bit about me I have completed multiple times Demon Souls, Dark Souls, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3 Sekiro and Bloodborne. Played them all, um, platinum them most of them. Um, something like Demon Souls original on the PS3. Um, is it Blade Moon shards or Blade Moon? The end Blade Moon. Maybe you needed to farm in 5 2 anyway. Um, was particularly annoying, so I didn't complete that. Um, I played through um, the Demon Souls remake, which was really, really good. That recently came out well, recently last year last year well no 2020 it came out um play through that i didn't put that on the channel because you know it's uh it was just a remake but elden ring let's get into it shall we um recording it on the ps5 um i don't have a 4k capture monitor so i've prioritized frame rate over graphics um yeah let's get going oh a bit nervous a bit nervous uh yeah, let's just do that got the brightness at seven i will turn that down if it is a bit too bright generally with youtube um things look a little bit darker so i tend to have it a little bit brighter on uh the screen let's get going select a base character it's just controls show statuses or status. So you've got a Vagabond, Vigor, Mind. So Vigor's probably health, Mind, FP, MP. Endurance generally is stamina. Strength is strength. Dex is dex. Just scaling's off them. Uh, explanation. There we go. FP and focus. Stamina, robustness. Okay, and a quick load. Cool. Strength based weapons. Dex, Dex scaling, yep. Reduces casting time, which softens full damage and makes it harder to be knocked off your horse. It's pretty, pretty amazing. Intelligence is spells, right? Yep. Faith is also different types of spells, incantations. Arcane. We had Arcane and Bloodborne, I think. Attribute governing discovery also affects holy defense, vitality, and certain sorceries and incarnations incantations i call it incarnations but incantations bring discovery so you get a bit of drop rate off arcane okay uh can't see what weapons you get so that's annoying it's a vagabond looks like you got a halberd a sword and a shield warrior is a sword and dual wield Hero is an axe and shield. Bandit. It looks like a dagger bow. Cool. Astrologer. Spells. Same with the prophet, I'd guess. Yeah, so that's intelligence. That's a sorcerer. That's your faith. Samurai. Got a bow. Got armor. Got a shield. Uh, Dex. Prisoner. Dex and sorceries. Confessor. Quality with a bit of faith. And Wretch is your level one. Yeah, there'll be a few people running that. But Samurai. It's going to be between a Samurai and probably a Vagabond here. Or a confessor. Having some faith. Got some good starting stats. You're probably going to be fat rolling, right? 13 endurance. That's got more endurance. Um, that's mind.
So Samurai has the most endurance. If I do find some decent spells, intelligence and faith is down. Uh, we'll go Samurai. Uh, lady, man or lady, I guess. Uh, samurai's, yeah, let's go for a male. Let's go for a name here. Uh, I'm going to use my other name that I use in games. Thirsty Ferret. Age, well, I'm... Middle-aged. Keepsake. No keepsake. The past has been well and truly left behind. Crimson Amber Medallion. Increases max HP. Land between rune. A gold of grace shining in the eyes of the people of the lands between. Used to gain many runes. Guessing runes is the souls. Golden Seed. Golden Sea washed ashore from the lands between. It's said to reinforce sacred flasks. Hmm. Another Esther shard. Uh, flask. Banged imp ashes. The ashes are a small, diminutive golem. Ashes are said to hold spirits within. Cracked pots. Three strange cracked pots that somehow mend themselves. A container for certain thrown items. Stone water key, two stone key shaped like swords, breaks the seal on imp statues, but can only be used once. The witching branch, five sacred branches charged with beguiling power, said to originate from the demigod Aquella. Beguiling. Does that mean we can turn them to us? Don't know. Boiled prawn, five pieces of boiled prawn, boosts physical damage negation. Like a consumable though. And Shabiri's Woe. The crazed likeness of a noble whose eyes have been gouged out. Attracts enemies' aggression. I definitely don't be wanting that. I'm tempted here to go for a golden seed. I don't know. I've literally, this whole time since launch, I've seen the, uh, a trailer and I've not seen anything of had a key for the network test, but decided against it because I wanted to go in completely blind. Um, haven't watched any playthroughs, nothing like that. So I don't know what's good and what's not. Now, is this a like a master key? I don't know. We're going to go for a golden seed. Feels like said to reinforce sacred flasks. Something decent. Detailed appearance. Uh, choose base template. Warrior. Wow. It's like Conor McGregor. Seafarer. Brennan. Like, like Newman. Do you think that is... Might go for him looking... I'm looking for a more samurai type look. You look very samurai -y to me with the ponytail at the back. So we'll go for a uh, reed lander and change some stuff here. Uh, I'll go for a mature voice here. Facial hair. Yeah, you look like a samurai to me. Probably just going to keep it base, to be honest. Because, yeah. We don't tend to see them that much. And I just want to get into the game. I've got a katana. Let's go for it. Ten minutes in. We just want to get going. Across the fog, 
the lands in between. Now, Queen Marika the Eternal is nowhere to be found. in the night of the Black Knives, Godwin the Golden was first to perish. Soon, Maricus' offspring, demigods all, claimed the shards of the Elden Ring. found strength triggered the shattering a war from which no lord arose a war leading to abandonment by the greater will Rise now, ye tarnished, ye dead who yet live. The call of long lost grace speaks to us all. Horalu, chieftain of the Badlands, the ever Brilliant gold mask. Fear the deathbed companion. The loathsome dung eater. And Sir Gideon Ophnir. The all knowing. Wow, that went loud. again bless a tarnished of no renown samurai cross the fog to the lands between to stand before the elder And become the Elden Lord. Nice. New the ring. It looks like a gesture. Okay. Uh, okay, we've got a shield. It's not great. Slow parry. Jump. We've got a jump. Okay, it's not. Let's have a look here. Equipment. With equipment menu, you can equip armaments, arrows, bolts, armor, talismans, and items. You can equip up to three armaments to each of your left and right hands. The actions each armament performs will vary based on which hand is wielding it. So we've got Uchi Katana. Nice. Got some arrows and fire arrows. Land of Reed's Greaves. Longbow. And a thorn, red thorn round shield. What's our quick load here? Bye. Oh, no, that's that. Uh, remove. Okay, we can fast roll now. Okay. Probably not going to use the bow just yet. Praise the Elden Ring. Look at them appraisals, man. 
Let's applaud that message because, you know, we've all been waiting for this. Behold, just getting started. Okay. Uh, read message. Though the path be broken and uncertain, claim your place as Elden Lord. Tarnished wizened finger. Uh, inventory. With the inventory menu, you can browse the items you're carrying, drop them on the ground, or throw them away. You can also use tools from the inventory menu. For a large image and explanations, toggle character data. Yeah, so that does that. Memory of the First Grace, which once guided to be gone, tarnished the lands between. Lose all runes and return to the last site of Grace visited. Graces are probably then bumped by type things. And runes, I guess, are souls. Now, if I call it souls, bear with. It's merely a cycle. Stand for the Elden Ring. Become the Elden Lord. And item for online play can be used from the messages menu. Use the right messages. Your messages will be conveyed to other worlds, allowing other players to read them. I think of what corpse wax. So emancipated, the bone is visible. It is a relic of those who came before, left to help those who would come after. Good. Good, good, good. Um, so, I... I Oh, map. I was trying to do a gesture, but hey-ho. With the map menu, you can check your composition with terrain and buildings in the surrounding area. You can also freely place beacons of light to serve as landmarks as you explore. And lastly, through the raw map, you can select any site of grace that you've discovered and travel there instantaneously. However, there are some dungeons and other areas where this cannot be done. Well, that's just a brilliant... Wow, please don't... Oh, no. Is that the whole map? Oh my god, it could be massive. Okay, let's get going. Let's actually... So you can charge. Stabby. Can you... No. Nope. What am I looking for? So you can jump and attack. That's a down. Okay, I keep trying to push triangle. We've been playing quite a lot of Monster Hunter recently. You get um, quite a few, uh, you know, you have to use triangular stuff. And someone's just beat outside, so apologies. Let's make sure there's no one trying to be in. There's not. So, back to the chair, and let's get going. Open. Oh, got another samurai verse. Touch bloodstain. Wow. Okay, so there is the Chapel of Anticipation. How good's that? They know, they know. Uh, no sadness ahead. Okay. Is there a run? There it is. Holding on circle is a run. First off, good luck. Yeah. treasure chest ahead well because then there's blood stains there i'm going to say no uh still got a shield up anything around here there is the door is blocked shut maybe new game plus who knows or we come back here camera controls we've got ah stairs First off, good luck. Yeah, well. Ah, it's so good to be here, man. First off, gesturing. Behold, something incredible. So it doesn't look like there's any... You're going to troll me, aren't you? Hidden path ahead. <laughs> yeah, of course. And you again. Try attacking likely hidden path. Yeah. Ah, oh, the players be trolling off the start. 
first off rump. Good luck. Precious item ahead. Uh, no. No, 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 no. You see the blood stains everywhere. Oh, God. Get Dark Souls 3 vibes off this. Praise the enemy. All right. Let's... Why is it always hidden path, but still no precious items? Beautiful. That it is a man. It looks good. Oh, d well done. Oh, well done. But time for futility. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anything here. Just people. It's quite a big jump, though. Strong foe ahead. Oh, brilliant. Praise the Elden Ring. Praise the Tarnished. Okay, let's check corners. Doesn't seem to be any items or anything we can pick up just yet. No, okay, let's push on. Got a gate over there. Oh. Grafted Scion. Okay. Wow. Okay. Well done, Paul. Again, I've pushed blimmin' monster under controls. <laughs> Scripted death, probably. There'll be some people who literally won't move on until they've done that. It's got to be scripted first death. Yeah. So it's going to take me a bit of time just to get used to the controls. I was only playing some Monster Hunter earlier today, so... Looking good, though. Oh. We have a steed. Okay, it's more of a... ox. Don't worry, Torrent. Fortune is on his side. We found him here, after all. One of his kind is sure to seek. The Elden Ring. Good. Even if it does violate the Golden Order. Oh, I don't care about the Golden Order. It's very dark. Very dark. checking OBS here just to see what it's like. Flask of Crimson Tears. Flask of Cerulean Tears. Guessing that's MP. There's an item up there. HUD display. Okay. Piercing required ahead. Wow. Very, very dark. I'm going to need torch. I'm going to need a torch. Uh, offer octopus. It does look like one, I guess. The cave of knowledge lies below. Why is it always jumping off? Brave Tarnish, take the plunge. I can't hear anything. Of learning and remembrance. 
control the arts of war and your warriors of blood. Oh, there's an item up there. Maybe we... Okay. There we go. Use item, switch item. Okay. Read message, enemy ahead. Sites of Grace. Resting at a site of grace will restore your HP, FP, and cleanse any status ailments. It will also refill your sacred flasks. However, most of the enemies you defeated will be revived. You can find Sites of Grace by going where light converges. These explanations are acquired in the form of info items and can be accessed in the inventory at any time. Okay, let's light our first Grace. Seems to me there could be a fire. Brilliant, I do like that one compass as well at the top I've just noticed okay let's push on time for a critical hit uh, reset camera lock on okay what else have we got crouch let's crouch here good damage 14. I thought that was an item then. Could this be an item? <laughs> Guarding. Use an ornament on the left hand or both hands to guard against incoming attacks. L1 to guard. Don't need to guard. We can just dodge. Need to get used to the dodging here. Dodging, there we go. Or we can just stab him. Right, okay. What else are people saying? Archer ahead. Be wary of Archer. Uh, jump. Jumping, oh jumping, it's like a dream. Right, so I won't read it. Mother of... materials materials in every corner of the lands between you will find fruits and flowers mushrooms and butterflies and various other useful materials these materials can be used for crafting okay. try two handing wow uh, each hand can be equipped with up to three ornaments following you to toggle between them ornaments can also be two-handed making attacks more difficult to repel if shields and boosting effectiveness for strength by 50 percent triangle and l1 r1 to wield with two hands okay cool uh what was it okay and that's how you get back cool Try back. Someone died to that dude. Not a hidden path. Okay, let's push on. Okay. So it swings quite quickly, this uh, Uchi Katana. That's going to be another troll. Yep. Ah, oh, Mr. Archer. Bows. Equip your bow to fire an arrow. You click up to two types of arrows to choose from at once. When wielding a bow with two hands, press L1 to hold for precision aiming. Okay, I'm not worried about that. Don't drop anything. No one else has dropped anything. Skills. Armaments have special abilities called skills. Skills are highly varied from range powerful attacks, so temporary effects. Skills use using skills consumes FP. Okay. Uh what happens if we do this? Okay. It's gonna be a bit of time to 
get that two hand. I'm used to doing triangle for two hand. Why is it I've always failed? Uh, crouching. Yep. Grass. <laughs> okay. So you can... I like this. It's telling me about back attacks here. Cool. Guessing we... That's there for a reason, right? We'll be in there later. Stance breaking. Some attacks may break an enemy stance, giving you a chance to perform a critical hit. Stance attacks and jump attacks make it particularly easy to break an enemy stance. Hold R2. R2 or jumping, jump attack. Okay. Wow. That's pretty good, actually. Didn't expect jump attacks, praise the Elden Ring. Pickle. Nice. What's this? Upon dying, you re-revived at the last site of grace that you visited. However, if there's a, st a stake of Marika near you when you died, you can choose to be revived there instead. Do I have to interact? No? Okay. Ooh, boss time. Try back. Okay. Traverse the mist. Okay, this is the area that we just saw. There's a guy there. Guard counters. Guard counters make it easy to break an enemy. Start R2 immediately after blocking the attack. Guard counter. I like that. Let's get a good shield. We'll be doing that a lot. This shield is pants. So samurai with a shield, obviously, you know, break the immersion. Um, what's this? Nothing. Okay. You can run and jump. Cool. So let's grab. Read message. Praise the gesturing. So that's where we came out. We got strength. First off, death, all the more, praise the tree. Okay. Still got that item there, which I couldn't see. Maybe we'll come back to that. Who knows? Let's open the way. Another Mr. Samurai. Anything behind? There is not. Let's go up the stairs then. Ooh, fog walls. Touch the grace. What's that? It didn't. Looks like it could be something. Nope. Nope. Okay. Uh, if only had a necessary item. Oh, is that one of them imp statues? Use the stones ward key. No, don't have them. So you can't get in here. Now, one of the things we had in Dark Souls 3 was these wall blocking loading zones. But I'm hoping, given it's the beginning of a new console, we don't have that. Purely corruptive multiplayer. Use tarnished uh, foiled finger to write a gold summon sign. Corruptive multiplayer will begin once you have been summoned by a player from another world. You take the role of an ally. And your objective is to defeat the area boss. The compass at the top of the screen indicates the direction of the summoner. Waves the fingers. Okay. Uh, okay. And tarnished furled finger. That's inventory here. Creates a summon. Sends another or oneself home. Okay, so if we don't like it, we can use the finger severer. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. Raise the lever. Okay. No. Nope. Uh, these are... Uh, can't see any items behind them. You can normally see a faint glow 
especially early game. And then I don't know what is determined as early game and not. So let's just go up. So when we're rising, first episode is going to be longer than normal. I normally try and keep them around 30 minutes. Uh, this will be slightly different, just depending on progression and stuff. You know, I'm not going to just stop it at 30 minutes just before, you know, while we're in the middle of a battle or something. Uh, but if we come... Ah, oh, you're an asshole. <laughs> I thought that was something then. He had me. That one had me. Um, you've died. There's a blood stain here. How have you died? Okay, bloodstain's not doing anything. Let's open. Ooh. Here we go. Limb grave. Wow. Look at this. That, that hill. Look at that tree. Look at that castle. Uh, okay. Anything around the back? Some stuff at the top there. Uh, okay. Row of fruit. What's this? Just a, a sign. Ah, gorgeous view. Yes. Yes, it is. Got some eagles. Just got to check. I keep hearing noises out the back of where I'm sat, so I'm expecting my food delivery still. So it'll be next door. Who knows? Apologies. It's got to be on the on the prowl. I've got no health. Oh. Uh, if we go, okay. Foxes. Keep thinking I was one way down, but you can jump. Oh, so. That's a bunny rabbit. What have we got? Thin beast bones. It's a dude on a horse there. Don't really want to go down there. Nothing there. Just looking for items. I've no idea where we're supposed to be going at this moment in time. Can we... Okay, you can sort of shimmy your way up. Uh, let's carry on around this way. Might as well do a loop. Uh, one thing I do want to check. Is durability a thing? Uh, bam, bam, bam. Does not look like it. That is glorious. We do get some souls for them. Uh, runes for them. Uh, elderly flower. Okay. Arsehole. Okay. Flight pinion. He's tried to jump down from there and obviously died. Ooh, what's this? We lock onto it. We hit it. We can. Golden rune. Nice. Golden rune. Texture like sun. Uh, don't really want to fight dude walk on a horse at this moment in time. There is something here. So that's where we would have come out. The dude up there. What's this? Examine. Summoning pools. In each area you'll find effigies of martyrs. These effigies are summoning pools. You'll find it easy to summon other players at these locations as co-op and hostile or su summoning signs created with a small effigies gather at summoning pools. We've got a small golden effigy. Okay, let's gather them. There's a dude up here. Uh, we've got... Ah, see, that's very 
I'm going to say Ghost of Tsushima, like, but that was more wind. But there's subtle things to tell you which way to go. But let's look at this. Um, no ashes, crafting materials. So this is all crafting stuff. Okay, golden seed increases sacred flask numbers of uses. Yep. Each katana, longbow, arrows, shield, helms. Uh, okay, that's what we got. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Let's touch the grace. Grace exists to guide the tarnished and lead them along the proper path. Even now, some sites of grace retain their power. The golden rays will guide you along your way. Okay, so it's actually sending me towards the church over there. That's good to know. The map. Use the map to check your current position as well as terrain surrounding structures. You can update the map with new information by finding map fragments at stells along the road. Deals. You can also use the map to freely place beacons of light to serve as a landmarks as you explore. Again, can't. It's a cave of knowledge. That's where I am, right? Okay, let's speak to this person. Oh, yes. Tarnished, are we? Come to the lands between for the Elden Ring? Hmm? Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. Wonderful. Luckily for you, however, there is one shining ray of hope for even the maidenless. Me, Vare. Take care to listen. Are you familiar with grace? The golden light that gives life to you tarnish. You may also behold its golden rays pointing in a particular direction at times. That is the guidance of grace, the path that a tarnished must travel. Hmm, indeed. Grace's guidance holds the answers. It will lead you tarnished to the path you are meant to follow even if it leads you to your grave. Anything else? Grace's guidance will reveal the path forward, most certainly, to Castle Stormvale, over on the cliff. Yep. The home of the decrepit demigod, Godric the Drafted. Cool. It's time you set off, I should think, to Castle Stormvale on the cliff where grace would guide you if you seek the elden ring maidenless as you are it's time to cast okay. if you seek the I'm always gonna exhaust dialogue where possible let's head over this way i don't really want to go near the bloke on the horse Ooh, not one of these things grab this I think it's yep, gone. Oh no. Another golden rune. Okay. So it's telling me to go over towards that old church place. Let's just slide on down here. Stay clear of him. Nope. Nope. <laughs> oh, buttons, Paul. Buttons. Acquire materials. Okay, Herba. Let's... There's more eagles that way. Something... 
Sorry. Oh, why is he rolling? Never seen a goat do that before. Thin beast bones. No, Paul, that's not run. I'm hoping there's like a medulla type thing where there's... Oh, sunflowers. Tarnished golden sunflower. Cool. What the hell is that? Okay. Let's move this way. We'll make our way towards that church, I think. Nothing else of note just yet. If we can make our way down there, though. Again, just looking for items here. It's going to be quite a bit of the playthrough, just exp exploration. So I don't know where anything is, but I don't really want to... That feels like I'm not surviving that fall, so... Bollocks. What on earth? A fucking giant. I don't want anything to do with him. Let's see what's in there though what on earth is that we try and take a giant on i oh, don't you know let's have a let's get our first proper death shall we wow okay no 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 Doing no damage to him. Stay behind him. <laughs> okay. You died. Yep. I've got to try on a big beefy boy before. It's fine. I need to go and get my souls though. Uh, runes though. Bollocks. Got about that. Okay. Well, death. Upon dying, you were revived at last. Sight of grace. You'll drop any runes in your possession at the site of your death. If you die again before reclaiming those runes, you'll be lost forever. The compass at the top of the screen indicates the direction of the lost runes. Yeah, over that way. Uh, so I don't want the horseman either. So the runes are by this thing. What's this? Okay, they respawn. The runes are this way, it says. There they are. I've got 600 runes, you know, that could be a level, for all I know, whenever I can level. Uh, let's hop up here. Gotta be careful of the man on the horse, Paul. Look at the map. Yeah, I'm miles away from where I should be. Surely we can get up here, right? Yeah. Anything worthy up here? Since we got up here, rune of fragment. Cool. Don't know what a rune fragment is. Uh, there's the church. There's man on a horse. Don't want man on a horse. Let's just. Yeah, there's man. 
You just kicked my ass. Got a goat. Again, okay, let's. Beast liver. Mushroom. Not mushroom in there, is there? Where the frick am I? We'll come back and explore this area. There's something. Let's head towards this. This is where it wanted me to go. Normally like to follow places like that, though. Uh, uh. Yes, yeah, so a powering blokey who's wandering around. Church of Ela. What? Right, let's just touch this grace. That bloody Santa Claus. Uh, on your map, you can instantly travel to any sites. Yeah, it just told me that. Uh, strengthen of armaments. At a smithing table, you can spend runes and smithing stones to strengthen your armaments. Somewhere in the lands between, you may meet a blacksmith who can make your armaments even stronger. Smithing stone. Okay, uh, let's talk to you. You're tarnished. I can see it. And I can also see that you're not after my throat. Then why not purchase a little something? I am Kale, purveyor of fine goods. Uh, purchase. With the shop menu, you can spend runes to purchase various items. You can also sell items for runes. Each merchant stocks a different variety of items for purchase. We've got cracked pot. Glad I didn't pick that. Telescope. Mm. Throwing daggers. Nomadic warrior's cookbook. Armour, I quite like mine. Large leather shield. Torch, probably useful. Crafting kit. Uh, let's buy the crafting kit. And buy a torch. And... You have a crafting kit, you can make various items from materials you find. Select item crafting from the main menu to make items. You can learn to craft more by finding cookbooks. You need you will need crack pots and other containers to craft certain items. You'll not be able to make more than those items and you have containers. Container items will run out with use, but containers themselves will remain. Okay, let's item crafting. The item crafting menu you can make various items from materials that you find. Yeah, he said that. So we've got fire pot, roped fire pot, bone dart. Okay. On horseback, feed torrents, restore HP. Uh, okay. Bone prisms. Reveals co op and hostile summoning signs. No arrows, though. Glad I'm not using my arrows right now. Uh, inventory. How many runes do we get? We get 200 per one. Can I sell them for 200? Uh, you can. That's good. Um, and now let's purchase. I wouldn't mind getting these. Probably could do with getting this as well then. But Note waypoint ruins. Flask of Wondrous Physic. Sure. And sure. Only 300. Might get the cookbooks as well. So what's that? 1,000. 1,300. What have we got? 600. Let's just do that. Cookbook 1 or cookbook 2? Let's go for 1. Nice 
place to do business. Okay. Item crafting now. Bone arrows. Cool, we can get arrows. Let's... Wow, you get 10 from one. Oh, 10 from two. Okay, that's good. Uh, map. Okay, that's not what I was expecting. Inventory. Here we go. Uh, examine. Notes held by the nomadic merchant imparting knowledge of the brief. A flask of wondrous physics still remains in the third church of Mar Marthica, north of Mistwood. Cross the highway bridge and follow the animal trail north. Somewhere lurks among the waypoint ruins on the roads through Limgrave. Someone lurks. In the ruins. Amongst the waypoint ruins. On the roads through Limgrave. Does that mean I've now got a. Maybe this? What I've just picked up? Who knows? Who the hell knows? Uh, da, 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 da. Right. I'm going to rest here. I think we're at 56 minutes. I think this is going to be a great time to. Uh, end this episode obviously very tutorially very beginnery we did try and take on a giant dude and got whooped um but we'll be back for some sweet revenge on him once we get a bit more familiar with the mechanics and stuff and i wouldn't mind taking on that guy on the horse as well but gonna just progress a little bit forwards um before we start to expand um maybe take take a look at you know that map that marker that was on there um and see what that does um, in the next one and yeah once things open up we will um yeah we will start to explore in a bit more detail but thank you very much everyone please like comment subscribe look good stuff really does help me out there'll be some more Elden ring coming your way shortly and in the meantime hope you're all doing well and i'll see you all as ever in the next one